Well, hello, Capricorns. Welcome to Sin, the Moon Goddess channel. I am Sin, moon, the Moon Goddess. <laughs> and I am here tonight to give you a reading for the week of, okay, the 18th through the 24th. Okay. Okay. All right, Earth signs. I'm a little late. I'm sorry about that. It won't happen again, I promise. Capricorn. Capricorn. Thank you. Thank you. All right, they gave you exactly 10. Capricorn. At the bottom of the deck is the Five of Swords. I'm sorry, the Five of Wands. And the Five of Wands is a little confliction. Not much, just a tiny bit. Now, first of all, I'd like to say welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you've never been here, I want to say welcome to Send the Moon Goddess channel. And also, if you haven't, Capricorns, Please hit that button on the right to subscribe to Sin and the Moon Goddess channel. We're going to get it in. Get it started. All right, where we are right now. Mm, being ourselves, the devil. We're just being us. That's all. That's all we doing here. Our challenges for the week. Ah, yeah, the three of swords. Either we grieving or we healing. But we're going to find out because, of course, we're going to clarify. All right. Our focus for the week. Yes. Our money, baby. And our goals. Yes. Yes. I hear we working, though. That's what I'm hearing. All right. Our recent past. Oh, yeah. Yes. The Ace of Swords, baby. We got an opportunity last week. That's probably why our focus is our money. Okay, our child, um, I'm sorry, our strengths for the week. It is the Seven of Cups. We've been working hard. Yes, we have. And it's time to take a rest. Okay, our future. Our future is the Eight of Wands. I don't know. You might not be able to take a rest because something coming in quick. We got to find out what that is. Our approach of the week. The seven of swords. We're overthinking and we're not trusting. You know, that's probably why I feel rushed. I feel like I need to hurry, 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 hurry. Is that what you're doing, Caps? Okay. <laughs> Our advice for the week is the princess of pentacles. Our money, our budget. Also, um, um, growth. Yeah, growth. All right. Our hopes and dreams. Ah, oh, that our king of cups to show up, a king of love. Yes. And our outcome of the week is the two of swords. We have to make choices here. All right, Capricorn. This is like heavy work here, really. Yes. Let's see what we got going here. All right, the three of swords. What, what is... Oh, what is this about, Spirit, the Three of Swords? Are we grieving here? This is for Capricorns, please, Spirit. Yeah. Yeah, they said they know it's Capricorn. This is your card. Yeah, something happened at home, your home life. Mm, either it's. Either someone is pregnant and don't want to be, or are we going through a growth and it have us in our feelings? Yeah, that's what some of us are. Some of us are pregnant, don't want to be. So that's the structure, the home structure. Some of us are going through a transformation and it has us all up in our head. Yeah, see, it have, have us all up in our head. And it, it's a new chapter in life coming along. 
Okay, the King of Pentacles in our focus. Our focus, spirit, our focus. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. You're going to have abundance of money in a minute. Just give it a minute. Yes. You looking like the star. The star. <clears throat> yeah, some of you guys might be pregnant. Okay. Yeah, because it's, it's nurturing here. You want you need to be you're nurturing. Yeah. Some of you some of you guys are gonna be disappointed because you didn't want to be pregnant, but you're gonna realize it's something that you you would love to have. A child. Because you have a lot of love here. Yeah. Okay. And this new idea is gonna bring you happiness. And a victory. And so is the ones that are pregnant. That's probably some of the news you're going to get in a hurry. The eight of wands. Some of it is going to be an opportunity for work. Some of you guys. Opportunity for work. Yes, it's going to uh, come by letter. Email even. Even a text I'm hearing. Yeah. You had a great idea at work. And it's going to change your life. It's going to bring you in uh, power. Power. Yeah, it's going to bring in power. But it's also going to bring in interference with your family life. Because you're, you're going to have to work more. And your love life is going to bring in interference. The King of Cups. We're going to do the King of Cups first. The King of Cups. Yeah, it's going to bring in a little confliction in your love life. Yeah, that's what is going to happen. Okay, uh, the energy I'm getting is water signs. The water signs is Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. And then we have Earth, but that could be you. But it also could be a Taurus. It could be um, Capric another Capricorn. Okay, but I got a lot of water here, a lot of water, Okay. So, but, um, someone's coming towards you with a, um, love offer. They want to start dating. Yeah. Some of you are going to start, like I said, a new chapter in life. And it's going to, you're going to start loving. It's going to, it's going to be rough at first. But spirit saying it's to manifest with exactly what you need want and need so they can bring it to you yeah see they send you worrying but they want they want see you going through this rebirth but they want to help you there will it is going to be some celebrations but you're going to have to you're going to have to make a choice too because you're going to be doing a lot you're going to be working a lot you're going to be working a lot so you're going to have success when it comes to work. You're going to have success when it comes to work. But you're going to have to like to learn how to juggle. Because it's like, it's, it's asking you to choose, but it's also asking you to, um, um, to juggle. juggle. Learn how to juggle your, your love life, your love life, your home life, and work. Okay. Yeah. S some of you guys are going to get married. They saying to get a pre prenup. They've been telling all y'all that. But spirit has. I don't know what's going on with this prenup stuff. Yeah. Wow. Virgo, Virgo. Hmm. Your money is going to look good. Or you dealing? You're gonna be dealing with a Virgo cap soon, and um, yeah, <laughs> they saying it's gonna be it's gonna be your um, soulmate. They here here to heal you, to help you go to the next level, to heal you. Tap into your intuition. They saying it. Your intuition is telling you, cause you already met this person. Yeah. You you already met this person. They here to heal you. It could be Virgo energy. Capricorn. 
Yeah. You you getting love offers. King um King of Swords. You got two. You got two love offers you need to choose. You you got air, you got air, and they say Virgo. Virgo. It could be a Libra. Or it could be another sign. It could be a water sign. Because you got a lot of water here. So it could, it could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and a Virgo. But they saying that you, you're definitely going to have to choose Capricorns. And you're going to have to choose now. And you're going to have to choose wisely. Yep. They saying you and the Virgo either work together or should work together. They saying that you guys, um, yeah, you guys, um, can work together and bring you guys happiness and healing. And they saying there's something you manifest. It's something you manifest. You're going to have victory when it comes to healing. Yeah. You're going to, you're going to be healing. Okay. That's um, Aquarius energy. Yeah. Yeah, Cap. Someone. Yeah, you come in here, in here with abundance. I think abundance of money. And, and it's saying teamwork. You need to do some teamwork at work so yeah oh you're getting married soon to your soulmate and they saying um you're tapping to your intuition and 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 also learning you're learning something uh, about a new opportunity to make you some money and uh, yeah you getting a love offer someone wants to ask you to marry them so you're going to have to get bound. You're going to have to learn how to balance, Cap. But someone wants to marry you. So you don't, you might get engaged this. this. If you're not, some of you guys might be pregnant. But it's going to be a victory this week. Some of you guys going to get an opportunity. Yeah, an opportunity at work brand new opportunity to be the boss yeah it's coming in it's coming in just be patient it's coming in soon and they saying to pray and meditate to do white caps pray and meditate yeah You are healing. It's the, the divine is with you. Helping your, you to heal and love. Stop overthinking. Trying to help you to overthink. You're going to be moving soon. Some of you guys are going to be moving soon. Yeah, I see you moving and it's going to be really a good move for you. It's going to help you for your future. She's yelling. Yeah, it's going to help you. Yeah. The divine is, is with you. They saying you, you walking into this blindfolded. Blindfolded. But they're going to help you. Because you're going through this transformation and the and but you you walking in blindfolded, they saying. And they they gonna help you. And there's gonna be a victory in love. They keep saying that. Yep, you're gonna have victory. Victory in love. What did I just say? Victory in love. All right, Cavs. That's all I have. Because they, they just keep saying the same. Look, this love that you have for, for a person, I think is a water sign. It could be another earth sign. 
So it could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, a Virgo, Taurus, or another Capricorn. But whoever it is that you're in love with, Capricorn, is going to last a lifetime. Okay? So a lifetime of love. That's what they're saying. But you don't forget you're going to have an opportunity at work too. So that could be something else too. So just be patient and let everything unfold, guys. All right? If you need me, I'm here. You can email me. You can put it in the comments. You can call me at that 877 number. I am Sin, the moon goddess. And I can't let you go without asking you to like and share this video and if you haven't already hit that button right over there to the right so you can subscribe to sin the moon goddess and i am sin the moon goddess and i'm out bye capricorn